New Paradigm of Spinal Treatment As the main cause of back pain and leg pain, we have focused on the mechanical factors such as disc herniation, ligament thickening, facet hypertrophy, and structural change like stenosis and spondylolithesis up to now. Recently, surgeons have paid attention to the inflammatory factors such as fibroblastic adhesion by bioactive material pro-inflammatory cytokine released from the impaired intervertebral disc and cartilage. As a result, the viewpoint for the treatment of herniated or ruptured disc has changed from the surgical or minimally invasive discectomy to the medical anti-inflammatory treatment. The medical anti-inflammatory treatment is divided into two steps of mechanical neurolysis and biochemical neurolysis. Mechanical neurolysis means to resect or dissect the fibroblastic adhesion around the nerve by the epidural neurolysis with epidural catheter or the percutaneous extrafloramenotomy with ligament resection. Biochemical neurolysis intends to administer anti-inflammatory medicines to the region of impaired disc and DRG, dorsal root ganglion, causing pain. At this point, if the fibroblastic adhesion is removed and bioactive materials such as pro-inflammatory cytokine are drained through intervertebral foramen out of spinal canal sufficiently, anti-inflammatory treatment can enhance the effect of treatment. Percutaneous extrafloramenotomy is mainly applied to the cases that DRG, dorsal root ganglion, is entrapped by the severe fibroblastic adhesion around target ligament, transarticular ligament, of intervertebral foramen, and it is difficult to use the caudal approach because of the severe adhesion around spinal canal. The target ligaments are different in accordance with spinal segments. It includes inferior and superior corporal transverse ligament and horizontal mid-transforaminal ligament in case of L1 to L4, and it comprises lumbosacral hood and corporal transverse ligament in case of L5. Epidural catheter for epidural neurolysis Product of our company for epidural neurolysis is BS Epidural Catheter. BS Epidural Catheter includes catheter body, toy, needle, sheath, and guide wire. This product set is characterized by two-way navigation by two navi wires in the inserting tube, good straightness by straight navi wire, smooth puncture without resistance by the sharp blade of toy needle, and smooth insertion by the tapering end of sheath. Extrafloramenotomy Kit for Percutaneous Extrafloramenotomy Our company's product for percutaneous extrafloramenotomy is the Extrafloramenotomy Kit, which is made up of trocar, canula, end mill, curate. This kit is characterized by smooth insertion by tapering part of trocar and canula. Minimal impairment of vital structures such as DRG, dorsal root ganglion, vein, and artery by blunt rim of canula, blunt blade of end mill, and cup part of curate, and easy recognition of direction by the mark on the handle of curate. Clinical Effect of Epidural Neurolysis and Percutaneous Extrafloramenotomy Epidural Neurolysis and Percutaneous Extrafloramenotomy make it possible to deal with not only severe spinal central stenosis by disc bulging, facet hypertrophy, and ligament thickening, but also severe surgical adhesion around the spinal canal inaccessible by transcaudal approach. In addition to this clinical significance, transforaminal approach eliminates the direct cause of pain through the nerve decompression by resecting the transarticular ligaments and trapping the DRG, dorsal root ganglion. 
in particular since ligament resection decompresses segmental vein and artery in intervertebral foramen simultaneously, the vascular insufficiency can be solved. That is, this improves the blood circulation congested in segmental vessels of intervertebral foramen so that it can promote the fundamental treatment of inflammatory process and the spontaneous regression of herniated and ruptured disc.